Let's take a look at the finishing technique of Chuck Taylor, the awful waffle. Thank you to Colton Hollis for the video suggestion and if you have any suggestions drop it down in the comments. To begin with, watch how Chuck Taylor clutches the opponent in a reverse scoop slam position, draping the left hand over the opponent's chest and throat and the right hand fixated on the opponent's inner thigh. As Chuck Taylor lifts the opponent up onto his right shoulder, the opponent is momentarily in a Canadian backbreaker position before straight away being turned onto their heads. Having completed that transition, Chuck Taylor drives the opponent down to the mat in a pile driver position with the opponent landing head and neck first onto the canvas. And as you can see from my example here, the speed and fluidity of the transition between those three steps makes this an incredibly lethal maneuver. And since the opponent lands on the aforementioned head and neck, there is a risk of a potential cervical spine compression, among other neck injuries. An underrated and devastating maneuver for one of AEW's best friends.